welcome back you guys I am gonna just jump right into this video so I wanted to show you guys my baby or yeah baby Breeza I got the baby Breeza and my sister got me a whole bunch of Dr. Browner Dr. Browner a doctor <laughs> Dr. Brown's bottles so I wanted to do um, not an unbox because I unboxed everything already and but I want to show you guys how everything works in case you're looking into getting the baby Breeza bottle sterilizer just to be just to tell you guys exactly what I have because I know there's a lot of baby Breeza uh, products out there but this is the bottle sterilizer and we're gonna use it together these are all gifts that I got on my from my baby registry I'll have it linked in my description so if you are looking into getting it you can click on a link and purchase it for yourselves if you're looking into getting it but um, because I got all those all these bottles today, I wanted to like test it out and see how they work. So this is how the platform looks. So this is where you put the water. They advise to put distilled water, but if you don't have none, I guess you know regular sink tap water will do just fine as long as you know that your water is filtered and clean and stuff. And then and then this goes in it, right? So. Um, I think it's pretty easy because this is exactly how I got it as well as this um, it looks like they sent me a used one which is fine so I want to show you guys how it works we're gonna try it out together I'm gonna read the instructions really quick and get back on camera once I'm done all right so just so you know there is a filter on the bottom just like anything else make sure you're cleaning out your filter and changing it as often as possible don't be that type of person that that's like oh my god I didn't know this had a filter like don't do that to your baby okay make sure you're checking everything to make sure there's a filter and then you're changing it out every month quite honestly because you never know we're gonna go ahead and fill this up with the filtered water quite honestly I'm not gonna move it I'm gonna take a cup and then we're going to Fill this bad boy up like this. Just a little bit more. They say not to go over the 120 ml line. In order for this to sterilize your bottle, your bottles have to already be cleaned. So I'm gonna take this time and clean out, clean the bottles fully. Um, let me show you guys the bottles that I do have. Big shout out to my sisters for getting me these darker browns. I think I already showed you guys. Pregnancy Brain is a mother. <laughs> so again, my sister got me these darker browns bottles, which are a great, and it was a great deal, she said. And it comes with a bottle cleaner, as well as, I think this is a teether. As well as like a sippy cup. So I'm going to go ahead and take this time and wash all these bottles the the heads to them like everything and then i'm gonna put it in there and then i'm gonna show you guys when i put them in there okay so for the sake of this video we're only going to do two bottles and i did not realize how many accessories dr brown's come with like this is two bottles but why do i have all of this back in the day bottles were like this at all um why is there a bunch of water right here anyway all right, so this is when you want to plug it in. I hope this isn't leaking. <gasps> Look at me, I'm already messing up. I feel like this leaked a little. Is that from the Dr. Mount? Oh. So I did go over. So be careful when filling this up because the water will come out. So it says not to go over um, the 120, which I don't think I did, but obviously I did, so the water came out. So definitely be mindful of that. Once you plug it in and then you place the top over. All the stuff are in. Putting it in wrong. Oh, this way. Duh. All right. 
So the top is on and then you press the on button. We're going to do this, which is, it's the, there's four selections. It's off. It's been 30 minutes since I put the bottles in the Baby Breeza. And so far, so good. It's been sterilizing. And then I think right now what it's doing is drying the bottles and the accessories that's in there. And whenever this is full, we still have this drying rack. Once we like wash our bottles, we'll be putting it in here. I'll link this in the description as well. But so far, it takes 45 minutes to sterilize as well as dry the Dr. Brown's bottles or any bottles that you may have. So while these are sterilizing, you can go and do other things around the house and before you know it, your bottles will be sterilized and dry. So I highly recommend it. Right, boo? Mm -hmm. You recommend mm -hmm. it? Yeah, okay. All right, you guys, so the bottles are fully dry. So I'm gonna go ahead and say I highly recommend these. Well, highly recommend the baby sterilizer and these bottles. Well, I don't wanna recommend these bottles yet because I haven't used them. But so far, so good. It sterilizes and it took 45 minutes for it to sterilize and dry. So if you're looking into the Baby Breeze bottle sterilizer, thumbs up. Definitely recommend. So this concludes the video. If you guys would like to see more videos, I do have a baby spa tub. So stay tuned for that video and I'll catch you guys in the next videos.